Hello everybody and welcome back to another Fallout 76 video. In this video we'll be going over my bloodied explosive commando build and the guns and perk cards needed for this. If you do like this video or find it informational, please leave a like and subscribe as it helps the channel out a lot. Okay, so into the perks we have Bandolier and Orden Express, 4 weight, commando, master, and expert, maxed out with tank killer and concentrated fire to help with vats, lifesaver, ironclad, and radical will help our health out a lot um, obviously we have tenderizer which will help our damage output we also have uh, nerd rage and with nerd rage we also have demolition expert helping our explosive damage and I also have science and science expert for a gun I will show you when we get to the weapon section we have action boy for uh, AP as well as marathoner covert operator evasive and sneak escape artists for our stealth we have adrenaline for even more damage output bloody mess for the same thing uh, grim reapers uh, sprint of course better critical serendipity class freak uh, starch jeans maxed out and critical savvy maxed out I used to run um, class freak 2 but recently I changed to Class Freak 1 in order to run Grim Reaper's Sprint as well. And another thing, we do have some essential perk cards. So Super Duper is going to be essential when you're crafting. Uh, you're going to want Gunsmith when you're crafting guns and editing guns. You're going to want batteries included if you run energy weapons in case you get overweight. And Scrapper is pretty much essential if you want to gain uh, materials and you saw hard bargain that's for our cpu vendors now into the weapons our first weapon i'm going to show you here is a bloodied weapon speed enclave flamer when you're looking at enclave flamers make sure you do get the aligned flamer barrel that's the best one uh this gun absolutely melts low levels high levels uh it's one of the best guns in the game for sure um you can see here like these low levels are just melting in a millisecond. Next gun I use here is a bloodied explosive uh, VATS critical charge um, fixer. This one is probably the gun I use the most. Uh, you can see here it's absolutely <laughs> insane uh, especially when you're you know your health is fully 95 percent down. Uh, here we have a handmade that's bloody and an explosive, not a great third star, but it is useful to uh, switch up the ammo types. As well as this, a lot of people like quad railway rifles, but I have a bloodied explosive. It's basically my sniper. It one-shots most things, and sure, it's not a quad, but I have fun using it, so that's really all that matters. Uh, the next weapon here is a bloodied crit damage um, ghost Tesla. Uh, like I said, it's just good to have different types of ammo you could shoot if you run out. Um, I don't really have that problem, but it's always smart. Uh, this is a bloodied weapon speed grenade launcher. If things get sticky, you know, if there's 10 people running after me, or ghouls, I should say, um, you know, I could take this thing out, and it, it, it even works great in VATS, too. Um, so this gun is, is very powerful, and, you know, it's not great to use at events uh, like you saw on the screen. Having an explosive build allows you to have some fun weapons like this. Uh, I'm sure it could even be better if I had a better legendary roll on it. Now, I like to say everybody should have a quad at some point um, in their inventory to help with bosses. Uh, this is a quad double vats, and it works great for me. Alright, that's pretty much all I got. If you liked the video or found it informational, please leave a like and subscribe as it helps the channel out a lot. And it's been Gonzo. Peace.